It's your guy, Boris Yeltsin, straight from Lavington in a four bedroom smart house. The smart house comes with a lift, it comes with a swimming pool, it comes with a gym, it also comes with steam and sauna. The four bedroom comes with a garage for four cars, and the entire third level houses a master bedroom. Without wasting much time, let's jump in and get to see what we have in Lavington. Follow me, let's go. This is your property from the outset. Before we jump in, there are things I'd like to mention on the outset. That is the Brookstone Zero Joint, as you can see. Very beautiful. And then let's look at the exterior of the property. I've got the white wall master, and I've got the black decking. I've got the tan decking, as you can see, and the glass. Yes. And even this green you're seeing here on the garden makes the house pop out nicely. You really appreciate the house at night. Yes. Yeah. And I also remember uh, from the front, yeah. it actually looks like Four levels, yeah, but from the back it looks like three levels. Yeah, you may think the three here are floating on air, right? Yes, yes, yes. Very beautiful. Yeah, come in, come this way. So this is the parking. You have got a parking, outdoor parking for two cars. You have got two parkings inside of the garage, and that means you can have four cars here comfortably. On this side is the gym, and then this side is your way to the house. Once you park the, your cars, you can just walk into the house straight. Let's go in. And also, yeah. don't forget, yeah. you mentioned there's a lift. So oh, yeah. access to the lift right oh, yeah. from the parking. Exactly. Yes. So you can park your car here and then access the lift to the other level of the house, straight to the master bedroom on top or any level you want to go to. Yeah. Yeah. For the visitors, they can use the stairs. Oh, for the visitors, you can <laughs> exactly you can just walk <laughs> to the house. Yes. Let's go in. So if I was a guest, this is how I could just walk into the property. Now, before we jump into the property this way, I'd like to mention a few things on the exterior where I am. Now, here, you can see the house looks like it's split into two. This is the first wing and the second wing. The first wing, the one you saw on the other side, looks like it has got four levels. And this side, when you go that side, it looks like it's got three levels. But then, this is the lift and the lift shaft, which you can see is going down. The property comes with the lift. Another thing that we need to talk about again, that is very, very important, is those windows, as you can see. Well-organized casement windows looks very good just from the outside. And also, the light gray wall master pops out nicely from the black casement windows. And then this one here is your garden. And I also like the space here allowing air circulation into the lower floor or the basement level. And also a lot of windows as you can see. All of these are windows allowing sunlight or natural light into the house. Paddy, what do you have to say? Yes, I mean, uh, this is a very good thought. Yeah. For having this space in between the buildings. Yes. They would have used this as more space to add even more rooms. Exactly, it, exactly. I like that. True. That's very but, true. And that would make this space between the two buildings so tight. very tight and dark. And then dark. But very true. But then this was a very good thought. Yeah. Because yeah, yeah. also remember you have rooms in the basement. Yes. Like in, in the law in the ground. Exactly. Floor. So you say it's impressive and a creative architecture. Yes. I mean just to sit down and think about lighting and you know air circulation and how far do you need to put the blocks, you know, very important. The word you're looking for is functional. Functional, exactly. Functional architecture. Yes. But Paddy, before we jump in, I'd like to appreciate also the amount of glass used in this property. Look at the glass. Look at the glass. Oh, yes. this is glass. And remember, glass is very expensive. Look at the thickness. Come close, show them the thickness. Look at the thickness of this glass. This could be almost bulletproof, I think so, I don't know. Yes. But it's very thick. So on the other side, I've got a swimming pool. I've got an outdoor space. You can just sit and, you know, do your machoma outside there. And also I've got a lounge that you can just chill. After having a swim, you can just go sit down and chill. Now, that's it on the exterior. But now, let's jump in and see what you have behind me here. Come, follow me. So before you just jump into my house, the things that are very important that caught my eyes is this door frame. The metal oak is beautiful, and you can see the black tone with the metal oak with the glass. Looks very gorgeous. Now, and then on the, my right hand side, there is this picturesque view on the entry foyer of the house. Very, very important, right? You don't just walk into walls, it's a glass, you can look at that. And remember, this glass or these windows are tinted. That means if I switch off my lights, you can't see what is happening inside. My floors are engineered wood floor. And then this one here is like a chilling area or waiting area before you're allowed into my property. Behind me here is a wall feature. 
right? Like a feature wall that has good zero joint coral stones comes with the property. On this side, you can decide to have a bookshelf here if you want to, or a deck wall, or just try to, you know, you know what to do, but it doesn't come with this. Follow me this way. Uh, Boris, before you go very far, okay. I like the thought of having this <laughs> this light fixture light, here. Light fixture okay. on the wall feature at the entrance because okay. it's also very welcoming. Uh, yeah. It pops out, yeah. just not a plain wall. Yeah. So it yeah. also gives, you can, you can see the textures on the wall very well. The details on the coral of the stone. Yes. Now what you need to say, Pad, is it illuminates the coral stones. Mm -hmm. You get to see the details on the coral stones. Mm -hmm. Very, very important. Yes. Follow me, come this way. So, Pad, this is our lounge. This is the real lounge, the main lounge, the primary lounge. Very huge in terms of space. You can put a lot of seats here. Behind me here is a smart system. This smart system can control the lighting, security, all that stuff. Let me show you. I can decide and have my house lights off, all of them, just click here, and they go off, all of them. Or I have my house lights on with the button. You can decide and even have dining lights off, kitchen off, all the stuff, then I can go back. Then you see, I can also play my music from here and I can connect this system with my phone and therefore I can play music from my phone at the comfort of my bed or any space in the house. And the good thing is with this music system, you can decide and play different music in different house. Meaning, if I have my room, I can just connect my room with my phone. That means I can play my choice in my room. Yes, yes Paddy, you have something to say? Um, I mean, that's a very important feature because maybe guys are playing some music in the sitting room. Yeah. You want to study in the bedroom, so you have your lo-fi chill exactly. music in the, in the bedroom. Yes. And then also since the rooms are very soundproofed, yeah. you can't hear what's going on. Oh yeah, stage. very, very important feature, Paddy. I mean, all these windows you're seeing here and even the doors into the balconies and all the stuff a double glaze, meaning there is zero noise or sound coming to your house. It's just quiet. The space is very quiet and peaceful. But there's something we forgot to talk about uh, this system here. This system here also has intercom. It means you can communicate with the guides at the gate from this point. So this feature or this system allows you to control everything in your house. Security, lights, communication, music, everything from that point. Now, party, very important. Now, on this side, this side have got a gilet balcony at the, at the lounge. This side, you mount your TV and those sockets you're seeing over there, those sockets are universal sockets. You can use USB, you can connect a lot of sockets at that point. You have got internet connection, you have got, um, how do you call it, Paddy? Cable. Cable connection, everything from that point. Now, Paddy, I said I cannot live without mentioning, mentioning this, right? And that is this action chair. I mean, it just caught my eyes. The finish, I mean, the quality is very, very beautiful. And it's very comfortable. Oh, let me try. For a leather seat. Can I try it? Try it. Okay, let me try it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> very beautiful. I love it. After you've bought the house, this is where you're going to chill. Exactly. But remember, remember one thing. It doesn't come with the house. It doesn't come with the house, but if you want it, we can order for you. Paddy, before we jump into the dining and the other areas, there's something you forgot to mention about. Look at that light fixture over there. It's geometric, I mean, I like it, <laughs> very geometric. Yeah, and also the way there's one cube floating in the middle of another one, very yeah, yeah. interesting. <laughs> yeah, very, very interesting. And it distributes light into every area of the house. Yeah. And I forgot to mention, Paddy, those ceilings you're seeing, all those bulkheads, have got two speakers that just gives music or distribute music on that space. Yeah. Now here, this one here, Paddy, just move them. Show them this space. Now this space in between is very important. The lounge and the dining are very far apart. Now there's ease of movement in between the spaces. Yes. Very important. Behind me, now this space is not only here, it gives you an entry into the stairs. And these stairs are mahogany, mm -hmm. right? Yes. Fitted. Yes. And then also, when you walk into, or you walk on these stairs to Going the other up. bedrooms on the other side, we have step lights that have good sensors. So once you step, it goes on. I wish they were off, I could show you. Now, this side, buddy. Here is my dining. Comes with this chandelier floating on air. The dining space is very wide. 
here, I have a mesh that allows air circulation into the stairs and every space of the dining. Yes. And also another thing that I think that does is allows the staircase to have light even during the day. Because if you'd have put a wall, it would have been very, very dark. dark. Another thing again is privacy. When somebody walks going up, you cannot see under. Mm, yeah, true, true, true. <laughs> yeah, you cannot see people, you know. Anyway, you know, some 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 ladies wear short uh, uh, dresses. So when you walk up, it's a bit of privacy. Nobody can get to see what's happening down there. Yes, yes, yes. Very important. <laughs> <laughs> So we go this way or we go that way? Uh, let's, I think the, the garden needs some Before attention. you jump in the garden, let me show them something. Yes, sir. I've got this foldable floor-to-ceiling French windows to the balcony. Okay. So can I fold them again? Yes, yes, yes. There's one you've left. Oh, there's one I've left. So I need to... Okay. Oh, wow. Look at that. Wow. <laughs> Very important. Yeah, the, the reason why we have this is to create more space if you want to. Sometimes you've got guests to have come and you want to, to entertain them. Now what you only need to do is just to do this. Let me just help you fold it that way, and then this way, and then I fold it. Not so heavy. That was very quick. Yeah, and the other thing about it is this foldable windows into the balcony a double glazed. Yes. And also I've got this mosquito mesh coming with the house. Don't forget the folded uh, doors also are tinted. Yeah, exactly. They're tinted, therefore you cannot get to see what is happening in the house when I switch off the lights. Yes. But Paddy, forgot something. Every window in the house has got sensors. So if anybody opens, yeah. the alarm goes on. I'll show you the I'll show you the arming system in the master bedroom. Just remind me, there's an arming system that can show me which window or door is opened right on which level of the house, yes. on the master bedroom. Just remind me, I'll show them. Very important. And don't, don't forget part as well. There is a motion sensor. Mm -hmm. Once I switch it on, anybody, any movement, I'll just get notified. Okay. So anybody who's sp spending 1.3 million who would also want to buy a security. Yes. Right. They, will, they always want to buy security. So they won't buy a house without, you know, very high-end security features, which you get on this property. Yes. I've got a deck here. So party, this is your garden, an elevated garden. This is pure and natural grass, not artificial. But it's something that I'd like to mention is this space can be used to chill on the weekend. You can, you know, play with your kid here on the evening or even on a Sunday or Saturday. And then, very important, if you look around the balcony, there are these hedges that are growing just to give you privacy in the balcony. Then you can decide to have this shade here, put seats here when the sun is scorching, sit here with your kid, you know, yourself, sit down, have a wine, or, you know, any juice when it's very hot. Yes, and Boris, you know, um, I'm a person who, I feel like I love people, having people around me and also bringing people over to my house. Okay. So if this was my house, I mean... Oh, no, no, buddy. That, no, no, that look, was look, my point. Boy. Look at this, look at this, look at this. So I'll throw it's it over to you. Okay. So I have okay. to introduce it so that you can finish Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so yes. all of this is space for entertainment. So clear line of sight all the way to the kitchen. Very, 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 very important. Now, the good thing is this, you know, we can decide and close that and have separate spaces, have the dining, I mean, have the garden and have the dining space separate and even the kitchen. But now, once you open it, you have the entire space for entertainment. True. You can decide to move those dining seats and have all this space to entertain your guests. Mm -hmm. It's very, very important. And I, I like the idea behind it because the garden is here, open the doors, all of it becomes... Yes. Uh, and there's so much space because if you're having family over, usually you use almost the entire house. That's very true. So, and even usually the way it's set up, the yeah. people talking at the balcony, yeah. living room, kitchen, yeah. but then it's Kids playing. very open space so yeah. that you can, can easily move. see someone, communicate well. Yeah, yeah. it means if, I, if we were here and maybe somebody at the, at the lounge can yeah. easily communicate with me, my wife is cooking on that side, we can easily communicate, guys are playing here, you know, there's just connection. Yes into the spaces. And remember, you can play the same music in the entire house. So, free-flowing music in the entire house. Yeah, that's very true. Uh, from the system, you can easily play the same music from the entire space. Oh, all the rooms can have the same music. If you want to entertain your guests at the same time yes. with the same music. Create, uh, maintain the same vibe. Oh, yeah. If it's <laughs> funny... Maintain the same energy. If it's funny... Funny to the end. <laughs> <laughs> if it's funny... To the end. If it's coffee, <laughs> coffee to the end. Oh come on! <laughs> then let's go this side, have some coffee yes. in the kitchen. <laughs> so, Paddy, 
this kitchen has a lot of details and I want to slow down, take them step by step. Now this kitchen, number one, is very spacious and it's a semi-open kitchen because the dining was on this side. Now, very important. This one here is a breakfast countertop. Or you can decide to have some wine on the weekend from this point. If you want to, just have a conversation with your wife while you're having some entertainment. Number two, it comes with these sockets here, which you can easily move and take them back and do that. Connect your appliances, like say, um, Blenders, you have good. Mention them, buddy. Uh, you have your blenders. Uh, How do you call it? The other one. Which one? The <laughs> coffee maker. The coffee maker. Connect any electronic. You can connect. Water heater. The, water heater. You can connect to this point and easily move and take it back. Or even your phones. Yes. You have a phone that you want to charge or play music or you know talk to someone. You can connect while you're cooking and it can still charge. So that means while you're cooking, your phone never goes off. You can connect from these movable sockets. Very important. Then I also like this feature, buddy. We can drop this and hide our blenders and phones charging just to organize the space. And I like the material, which is aluminum. And therefore, it never, it never rusts. Yes, yes. Very important. Another thing, buddy, dropping planet lights. I've got a speaker here that you can play music from. I have also, it comes the microwave and an oven inbuilt. Look at this. Comes an ill built fridge. Mm. Very important. Wow. Comes the house. In the actual, in the other house, this is our show house. In the other house, we're giving you two fridges up to this point. Mm -hmm. Now, for this one, you only did one. But you know, being that it's a big house, you cannot only have this. You like have a double the fridge or a very big fridge. So, it gave you two. Two. Very important. Now, I'll show you something down here. In as much as this is used as breakfast countertop or even say you can use it to cook and all that stuff mm -hmm. there is more storage down here yes you know you can store your stuff down there mm -hmm. come this way paddy look at that beautiful another organizer you can put your stuff there you know look at that a mini or a very small pantry store your stuff close it look at that more storage down here look at this more storage more storage here we have a four burner cooker with an induction of two and then this one here is your extractor Look at that. It just extracts. Immediately I bring it out, it goes on. Goes off, very important. Then this one is more storage with hydraulics. Look at that. Then I can close it again. Never bangs, very important. Even this doesn't bang, doesn't bang. Soft close, very important. I've got more storage down here. Then this one here is another storage space again. This one you can put your spices here if you want to, very important. Take it back, closes. Then I open this again to show you something. Paddy, come this way. Lazy Susan, very important. Just to give you more space and more storage in the house. Take it back. All these are drawers. Let me show you something. Then here is your dishwashing machine. Inbuilt comes the house, very important. Close it. Here, I have a water purifier. That means I can drink straight from the tap. Very important. Then again, I've got my garbage cooking. I've got some, you know, things I like to drop them. I can just drop them here into the bin. The once they close, it goes inside. Yes. So there's something that I think you are overlooking. Okay, but tell I me about it. I want to talk about it. Yes. See these windows? Yeah. They open up like the folding doors. Exactly. So you can extend the entertainment <laughs> space all the, the way to the Yeah. <laughs> because right outside we have a uh, like a counter yeah, seating. Counter seating, yeah, exactly. So you have space for like you can serve directly. Yeah. To the to the counter space or yes. counter table. Yes. That means you can fold these. Once you fold it, you can decide to serve your guests or serve your family and all the stuff from here straight into the counter space on that side. As they're swimming, as they're doing their machoma, as they're having fun. Say you want to give them some drinks, you know, just grab it here. On this side, give them, then, you know, it just becomes an entire entertainment space. Yes. Very important. Don't, 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 don't go anywhere. I mean, the shoot or the video can be too long. That's okay because the house has a lot of details to be shown, right? So here, I have got hanging shelves here. You can hang your stuff that you want to easily access while you're cooking. Just here and here mm -hmm. comes the house, yes. very important. This is the kitchen island in between. There are more drawers down there, more cabinet spaces down there, very, very important. We can put two seats here, have your, you know, meals from here, or we can use this also for what? For cooking. Yes. Paddy, very important, the mail walk, beautiful from the textured tile, look at that. The door frame, very gorgeous. And then this is a bando. You don't, it doesn't open out or open in. 
Why? It's because of space. And then also, the reason why we did this is to make the kitchen very private. Yes. If you want to have an open kitchen, fully open, I can open. slide this and have a fully open kitchen. If you want to have privacy in my kitchen, I... Bye bye, see you in the next space. So this is my clock room, a very unique clock room. Come in. A clock room that comes with that magnifying lens. And the sink is very unique. Look at the shape. Very creative. Yes. And the walls. Doesn't come with this wallpaper, but even the person who did the wallpaper was very creative. But then Paddy, in the washroom, remember, have got hexagon texture tiles. Mm. Well, I mean, it's the first time I've seen this kind of tiles. Yes. And also, it's not just uh, one plain color. Yes. It's two different colors. Yeah. So it gives it some very good contrast. Oh, it's, yeah. It doesn't look like a plain flat wall. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It gives the character very, very important. Even the toilet is well centered. There's more space around it. Casement, frosted windows, very, very important. And, party, very important. On the clock room, you don't have the sink in the, the clock. clock. In the toilet area. Yes. It's separate. So you can use the sink while somebody uses it. Exactly. At the same time. Very important. So we're going into the lift. We go to the next level. We're going down. Let's go down in the basement. So from the lift straight to this level. Now this is like our ground level, which kind of feels like a basement. This door here, once you park your car down there, use this door to get in from the garage. Then you can use the lift or the stairs up. Now very important. This door is a top security door from Israel. Paddy, there's something you want to mention about this door. What yes, do you yes, want yes. to mention? Um, what the developer explained to us is that the door itself is made out of wood on the outside, but there's a steel plate. Yes, yeah. thick steel. Thick steel in the middle of the yeah. of the of the of the of the wood plates. Yeah. yeah. So it makes it like very strong, strong. and solid. So yeah. So it's bulletproof as well. Steel. Yeah. Let's go in. This is the gym. So this gym doesn't come fitted, right? But then again, it's upon you to decide what you want to put into your gym. If you want to do more aerobics, you can put more aerobic equipment. If you want to do weightlifting, heavy weightlifting, or if you want to combine, that's upon you. This side comes with the steel and the sauna as well, and also have good enough windows bringing air circulation. But also, Paddy, look at the position of the gym. It's well placed. You know, having a gym on the half half floor, so, you know, in between, mm -hmm. dropping dumbbells and you know weights is you know causing commotion yes. and becomes very uncomfortable. Yes. But then, while it's placed, it's separate. In fact, it's tucked away from the property itself, yes. making it easy and you know uh, reducing noise and sound in the house, Paddy. Yeah. yeah. Perfect. So I think we can look at Before you go, Paddy, something you think when you're going around and you mention it that, you know, uh, even where the gym is placed, when anybody's walking into your house, you can easily get to see them walking in. Yes. So giving you also, you know, become also security by yourself, get yes. to see what's happening yes. on your garage and the parking. Mm -hmm. Yes, Paddy. And also the windows, like you mentioned, tinted windows. Oh, so yeah. Then they can see what's going on. But you can see them. Yes. Very important. Let's go this way, Paddy. Come. But before we walk in, this side is, there's a space under the lift that can be used as a wine cellar, right? Or summer room. Yes. Very important. But then before you go into the cinema room, these doors are very beautiful. The Mary Oak, Mary Oak with the black tones, you know, the Mary Oak pops out nicely from the black tones of the door. Yes. Very beautiful. Yes. Uh, is this uh, steel or? Yeah, it's, it's just it's, painted. It's wood, but painted black, black and mirror oak, very beautiful. Then it opens, you get into the cinema room, they've got all this space for your cinema, you can just decide and have, let me just show you something. I can have night lights off, mm. then look at that, you can watch the wow. TV, get to see what is happening on that wall, comfortably from your seats, or I can decide to have the lighters, you know, off and have that light, ambient, it has, ceiling. It has a light. very good mood. Exactly. And I'd like to add this, um, this is a heated, yeah. heated and massage. Oh yeah. But I don't know if they come with the property. If you want to, we can also provide that. They are, they are heated, they have a massage, they can cool your drink and even warm your drink mm. from the seat. Yes. Yeah. And also another thing, I like the, the glass, the... Yeah, the thick glass. The thick glass. Is yeah. it frosted? Uh, it looks frosted, mm -hmm. very thick. But then again, that glass allows natural lighting to penetrate into this room. Yes. If you want to have natural lighting. But then again, for cinema rooms mostly, I think you'll go with dark. It's usually dark, but it allows in a little bit of light. Oh yeah. Because when you switched off the snake lights, yeah. it looked very cheap. Oh yeah, very true. Now Paddy, before you go, this is something I have to show them. Can you guess what, what this is? Um, I think it's a cellar or a fridge. <laughs> Come on, I told you, you didn't know. <laughs> <laughs> this is a fridge. Yeah, look at that. Very antique. Mm -hmm. Doesn't come with the house. 
but if you want to, but I can buy you this. It's for wine. Yeah, you can put your wines here. You can put your wines. Look at that. You can put your wines there, right, and have them when you want to watch. Go straight to the seats, mm. have your wines, or I can serve you. Sit down there, serve your drinks from the fridge. Let me just lock it. More storage here. Look at that. Very important. Then I lock it. That's it. Beautiful. Let's go this way, buddy. Show them this side of the property. Follow me. Come see what you have here. Now, this property has got these top security doors on very important points. Now, this door gives you access to the garden, gives you access to my two SQs, gives you access to my wet kitchen, which is on this level, and also it gives you access to the swimming pool and the outdoor space on the first floor. Yes. Very important. Now, that side, that is my garden, as you can see, mm -hmm. and that's the lift area. So you wanna go into the lift, then go to the second floor of the house. Remember, we walked up when you're starting, went to the first level, then you went down. So you're going up, don't go anywhere. Stick around, I wanna show you something on the second floor, don't go anywhere. From the lift on this second level of the house, I've got three bedrooms with the family room. Come this way. The family room is well spaced, has got enough space in it. There's that window, right, that is double glazed, allowing natural lighting into the family room. But also, nobody can get to see us from outside. Why? It's because they're tinted. Very important. The house doesn't come with the furniture. As you can see, the furniture is just used to stage the property, not coming with the house. Now, this wallpaper, Paddy, the wallpaper looks very gorgeous. Very, very gorgeous. Giving us an old school vibe on the wall, like a map, Paddy. What do you have to say, Paddy? Um, I'm not the biggest fan of the vintage type of uh, wallpapers, wallpapers okay. because it just screams a lot, like there's so much going on. Okay. So I'd, I'd prefer maybe a minimalist look. If this was a white wall, I'd, I'd have appreciated it. Okay, you like too. it cool and relaxed. Yes, but given the way they staged the house, I think that goes Simple, very well. Simple, classy, and very rich. Yes. I like it. Mm -hmm. Then also the light, light just goes in, and even the paints using the wall, mm -hmm. they easily reflect the light back, so yes. it brightens the room. Mm -hmm comes with these lights you see here and, you know, the snake lights on the ceiling. Buddy, yes. let's go that way. Show them what we have on the side. And before we go, Boris, to the next place, I think uh, there's a very minor detail you might have forgotten. Yes. And it's the mini garden. Artificial garden. Artificial garden. <laughs> yeah. Just on the edge of the window. Yeah, very important. It comes with that space over there. You can decide have it artificial or you can decide plant uh, uh, you know, have a garden, a real garden over there. But then again, the problem would be, guys, you have to pass into your, garden, into your family room and, you know, water the garden. But I just Ma go with that feature. Maintaining it would be a, vi a, bit, difficult. a, bit, a bit difficult. Yeah. Yes. Since this one doesn't move, yes, yes. you have just to open that and go. So artificial would work well. Yes. Let's go. Yeah, so here is our first bedroom on this level. So you're going into the bedroom. Come inside. Yeah, so Paddy, now this one is our first bedroom. This first bedroom, you can do twin beds. It's very spacious, as you can see. It has got more space. And then, very potent. Comes with a full-length mirror. Look at that. It comes with this full-length mirror and sliding uh, closet doors. Here, it's well organized. You can put your watches, jewelry, all the stuff on these spaces. It's a very unique thing in a closet. And I've only seen this in this property. But of course, if you walk to, into high-end listings, you can get to see that. You can hang your trousers here, look at that, and organize them neatly. Then this opens out and closes. I've got wall brackets on the wall, which also brighten the wall. Paddy, show them these wall brackets. Light, where is that night light? Look at that. It's very beautiful, they're very bright. And even the design, very, very geometric. As you can see, it goes off, the light is on, chandelier is on. That's it. So we jump on that side, see what you have in my washroom, come this way. I've got this bundle that slides, opens. This washroom comes with the anti-mist mirror, smart mirror. It means the mirror doesn't fog up. And then again, look at these marble-like tiles on the wall, very huge white and black details in the washroom. Black and white is consistent in this washroom. The shower cubicle opens out. In the shower cubicle, have got rain shower on top. I've got those textile tiles, very gorgeous. Each and every washroom in this property or every bedroom has got its unique tiles. They're different. 
You'll see it in every washroom, they're different. This casement windows, frosted, you know, more light into the washroom. And this one here caught my eyes. So this recessed down lighter here has got a very unique feature that I have to mention. It has what we call anti-mist. This one. It's different from all the downloads you've seen in the house. Very unique feature, buddy. So I think uh, you'd notice in normal uh, bathrooms, yes. usually sometimes when, you, when you're showering, and the light and the and the steam is going up. Yeah, it fogs up the light so yeah, it becomes so, very dim. Yeah, so it's not so clear. Yes, but now this one is, has anti mist, so therefore it can never never fog up. Yes. Yeah, it means you've got lighting in your washroom. Let's go. Now before you jump outside, I'd like to mention a very important feature, another security feature in the property. This one is a panic button. Maybe the kids are sleeping and something happens. Maybe it's an accident. Maybe somebody has fainted. You can switch on the panic button, then the alarm goes on, and you know we'll have guys here to assist you and help you out. Let's go to the other side, see what we have on that side. So from the lift here, I've got this corner here, which you can put your console table, put your flowers, you know, just beautify this corner here. Straight this way, buddy, show them something. On my right hand side here is another bedroom that is en suite. So come in, see what you have inside here. So this is my second bedroom. It's a bit different from the other one. Here, it's a bit bigger than also the other one. My washroom is also bigger than the other one. I've got a gilet balcony over there, you don't have it on the other side. I've got French windows here that can give you access to the balcony, very important. This way is my washroom with a very big shower cubicle which can contain even three at a go if you want to. Because I've got single rain shower head, I could remove this and put even three here. Or even say two. <laughs> I mean, this, this, this is usually my best bedroom in this, in this property. In this property, because the washroom is just so big, like the oh, it's shower, big, yeah, shower yeah. cubicle. It's so shower big. cubicle. In fact, it's one of the biggest shower cubicles you've ever seen in washroom. Even master washroom don't have this kind of shower cubicle. This is very huge. The toilet is separate. You've got your sink over there. You've got that smart mirror, anti mist again. As you can see, sliding bandos, more space in it. The sink is classy. I mean, everything here is oozing class and luxury. Buddy. And I felt something very warm behind me. Oh, exactly. Which was the... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's very warm. Yes. Very true. Now, it comes, every washroom in this property comes with this heated towel rug. So you can easily, after taking a shower, wipe yourself, you can hang it here, and it dries. This way. Let's go. Buddy, something just to notify our viewers. Uh, every space you've gone to in this property has got chilling spaces. Yes. Like when you walk into uh, the entry foyer of the house on the left hand side, there's a chilling place over there. Here there's one, there's another one there. So everywhere you're tired of walking, you can just sit, chill. You can even mount a TV if you want to, or even a gaming area. You can put a TV here, kids can game here. Because it's three bedrooms here. You've got your kids, they can come here, play PlayStation, the game, you know. Very important. Yes, um, this is a house for a big family. Exactly. And having a big family, sometimes you, you just want somewhere quiet that you can just sit and relax yeah. and uh, unwind from That's very true. It's busy city. everyone else's energy. Yeah. So I think this uh, works as a very good spot for that. That's very true. Yeah. And even that side, I've got that console table over there. You can put your flowers, you can just beautify that corner, very important. And then every space you go to the property has got windows. Yes. Very important, building natural light into the space and even air circulation. And then, this bedroom is a bit different. It doesn't have a dual balcony or say just a window, but it has a real balcony in this bedroom, not a master bedroom, but just like any other bedroom. Let's go in. But this is a bit different. I mean, this bedroom is blessed with something unique. In as much as it's smaller than the other bedrooms, of course it's on suite, it has sliding, you know, wardrobe doors and full of mirror and anti mist and different tiles in the washroom. This one, has a bigger balcony as compared to any other bedroom on this level. So this, I could give somebody who likes much of the outdoors. Yes. Like my kid was like, who likes much of the outdoors or maybe somebody who wants to just to have the balcony and smoke so it doesn't interfere with other people with the property. You know, it's very important. This will be the space. And I think this would also make for a very good guest room. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Because it's just uh, on its own. Separate. Also, the way it's hidden from the other bedrooms. Yeah. Right next to the staircase. And yeah. Then, I mean, having the balcony also adds adds as to why it should be something like a guest room. Okay. Now it's you have more privacy for yourself. Exactly. That's very true. Now this balcony wraps around all the way that side. 
from that side it becomes a tulip balcony. Here it's Much huge better. balcony. Yeah, come in. I want to show you something before we go to the other level. It's very important, like I showed you, or like I told you, in each and every washroom, I've got different tiles. Now here, I've got these huge tiles, black ones. I've got textured tiles, different from the other ones. This one is not wallpaper. These is textured tiles in the washroom. Paddy. Wow. Very beautiful, man. Wow. Very beautiful. And then also just the glass finishes. They just add, add a touch of glass. Yeah, into the washroom. Every time they find an opportunity. Put a glass on it. Yeah, just to <laughs> give it glass. And even the sink part, look at the sink. It looks like a stone that I've just been, you know, they've just uh, dug it or carved it nicely yes. or even shaped it nicely. It doesn't look like, you know, a pieces that have been combined. Yes, yes, yes. Looks like it has been, you know, carved. Mm. Very beautiful. I like, the, I like the sink, but it's so, so beautiful. This looks like pure granite, right? Yes, yes. Oh, this is granite. Right? Exactly, pure That's granite. Right. Very, very beautiful. Here is your toilet, this is the shower cubicle. Of course, shower cubicle is a bit smaller, but the space is not that small. Yes. They've got more space on your sink, toilet, and the shower cubicle. I mean, normal shower cubicles are that size, so it's very reasonable. Yeah, 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 yeah. and even look at that, that black. The black on the side, black on this side. Then the gray textured tiles on the wall, even the floors. And then they slope down into the drainage. Even the drainage is unique. Look at that. Very unique drainage, look at that. I mean, these guys took their time and even put a lot of money into having such kind of finishes in a property. It's the very little details. You can even see how the vanity is uh, yeah. designed. It's like a stack of steps. Oh, oh steps yeah, design. I didn't notice that. Yeah, you can see that. Looks like a step, you know? Then you see, you can just open that, then you can close it. Soft close, very important. Let's go see what you have on the next level of the property. You I mean, it will shock you. Don't go anywhere. I've got the best flow of the property above us here. Let's go. Okay, so Paddy, before I jump into the master bedroom, lounge and uh, you know the master bedroom itself this space here can be used to put a console table and beautify it you won't have just empty and plain corridors in the property let's go in buddy before i start talking about the house i like to talk about the door again i told you i've got these top security doors from israel bulletproof very very secure anybody's looking to spend 1.3 million security is top on the list. Yes. Very important. Paddy. Yes. This is wow. This is very, very beautiful. High ceilings on the highest floor. Yes. Now, and the entire space here, entire floor is just for the master or the primary or the owner of the property has all this to enjoy. And it doesn't matter. Even if they're handicapped, you know, they cannot walk, the stairs can still serve them. They don't need just to find a way of walking or moving to the highest level. They can use the lift. Now, all this is not the master bedroom, but the master lounge or the primary lounge for this master bedroom. You want your TV on the side, but then I like, buddy, I like something about the furniture. The white, 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 some, you know, laid back, dull furniture, just giving you chilling, you know, a chilling effect. You just relax, you walk in, you feel like, man, I need to sit down before I even change my, my suit. Just sit down. Put your briefcase here and relax. Just before you get into your master bedroom. Yes, yeah, so those aluminum levers are movable. You can easily move them and then they make your lounge very private. Mm -hmm. Or you can open them and have more light into your lounge. So when you sit on that egg chair, right, you can decide, move the aluminum louvers, make it private or open it and have a view of the neighborhood. Mm -hmm. Now let's go this way, buddy. Yes. So like I told you, I mean, that terrace starts from that point all the way to that side and it's depth. Right? Come in. I mean, buddy, before we just talk about this, this master bedroom going the other side to the washrooms, I'd like to talk about this side. This side is a private terrace for, you know, the owner of the property. And all this is for you just to chill and relax. Now, look at this. These louvers, these aluminum louvers can easily be moved. You can decide to make this side private or decide to have that side more private. And remember, on the outside, it's just glass, meaning it looks so beautiful on the outside. On top, I've got these concrete pergolas bringing light into this area and the floor is nicely decked, even the wall is nicely decked and those cylindrical spotlights just illuminating that wall on the night to look so beautiful. This side, come. All this space again for you. You can sit down here on this egg chair, have a very beautiful view of the neighborhood and something just to, you know, make you know is 
I've got this skylight on the top, you know, bringing more light to this space. You can sit here even when it's approaching the night or it's getting dark. Let's go in. Here is this foldable double glazed French windows. Look at that. So you can decide to close this and make your bedroom more private. Or sometimes you want to have the entire space open, you just feel like you want to have the, the outdoors and the indoors at the same time connecting. You just fold this. Let me just show you how we do it. You fold it and you open it that way, right? Yes. Very, very important, Paddy. I mean, you have all this space for yourself and light just goes in, fresh, fresh air goes in, it becomes a very big space. Yes, and what really amazes me about this space is that you have an entire floor. Yeah, for yourself. Just for the for the primary bedroom. Bedroom, yes, yes, yes. An entire floor. That's, okay. Have you ever seen that anywhere? No, no, it's, I mean, it's the first time I'm seeing this because I've got, if I wanna watch TV, I wanna chill, I can go to my primary lounge yes. for the master bedroom. And it has its own door, which makes it very private. Exactly. It's like you're having a one bedroom. Yeah, exactly. your five bedroom. Exactly, so once you walk in from that door, everything is just at your disposal, at your disposal. for you and your partner to enjoy as you're aging gracefully. And I want to repeat that point. Yes, buddy. There is no unit we have seen that yeah. has an entire floor for the primary bedroom. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Never. Even the this mansions, is the first. even the most expensive ones, there is none in the market that's got the entire floor for the primary or the master bedroom. And everything and only one door to access the master bedroom of the entire floor. Yes. Am I clear? Yes. If I'm clear, then let me close this. We go to the next point. Look at that. Let me just close this. As you can see, when I put my foldable, you know, doors into place, now this becomes a private space again. Now this becomes a master where the bed now sits because the entire space is the master bedroom. That is your lounge, bedroom area, and then all this space for your bed. You can decide to put whichever size of bed you want to put. You can put it. Very important. That space again becomes your chilling spot if you want to. There's another space that is hanging on that corner that you can decide to put another seat if you want to. Very important, buddy. We go in, see the walkthrough closet. So, buddy, this is the walkthrough closet, right? I've got drawers here. I've got place you can just hang your trousers. I've got sports. I, I can show you. There's a drawer over there you can use to put your jewelry, watches, and all the stuff. But then again, this glass here really amazes me. That means I can decide even put something that, you know, we can easily get to see from here, like my golden watch, uh, like necklaces, you know, like silver, gold, diamond, name it. I mean, anything that has got uh, the precious stone will really work very well here because you can easily get to see it once the light hits this glass. On this wall here, so these closets have got sensors. Once you open, the lights goes on. That means uh, even when you close, uh, it go off, of course, but then the lights will go on. Even when there's light in the day, natural lighting, you can get to pick what you're supposed to dress that day. Now, this space here has got three full length mirrors. That means we can easily dress at the same time, me and my wife. Very important. Now, let's go this way. I also like the space in between here, you know? That means I can use this as my partner uses the other side. At the same time, we don't waste time if you're running to uh, go to work and get to work as early as possible. This corner here can be used to just accentuate it with a nice seat here with a coffee table over there, have a very beautiful view of the neighborhood. In that space there, you can also add some artificial garden on the space, you know, very important. I told you, every window on this property is double glazed and they have sensors, as I told you before. And I was supposed to show you the arming system part, you forgot. The arming system is in the master, is in the, in the lounge on this level, the arming system. That means on the system, I can get to know which door is open or closed from the arming system. Remember, this arming system, there is the panic button, there is sensor, you know, um, motion sensors on the corridors, there is these sensors on the windows, and there's also top security doors, just to make sure you're very safe in your property because anybody spend that kind of money would not risk only security. Now, Paddy, switch this. Oh, before we switch, Paddy, <laughs> here, I want to show you something. You see this? This is where you can put your very precious jewelry or say watches, put them here for them not to get scratches. Very important. Yes. And you know, Boris, yeah. <coughs> you notice they, they don't do that just for one closet. On that side, I noticed there's two of them, and on this side, there's oh. two of them. Oh, yeah, let me so show them. His and hers everywhere you go. 
There is one here, there is this one here, and then there is a laundry basket here, mm -hmm. the laundry basket, and then there's another one on that side, just for your jewelry. Let me open up, show you something here. Come, buddy. See, glasses here, you know, and these glasses, you know, they just naturally light up. Light up. When you move, it just goes on. Then the light will just limit it down. You get to see what you want to pick. Yeah, yeah. Here, I think a lady would put her bags, her precious bags. Oh, sure. Yes. Maybe. Oh, okay. Handbags. Handbags. Yeah. Just very good display for. for oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. And then also another thing that we have told the guys um, watching yeah. is that this property has a very hidden. Oh, yeah. The panic, the panic room. Panic. The room. panic room in every. A master bedroom of these properties. So, you know, in case there is any panic, maybe there is a, a, a how do you call it? Somebody just broke into your house, maybe the tags, God forbid. There's a panic room hidden somewhere here, so you can easily go into the panic room, lock yourself, and the panic room has good top security door. That means nobody can break into it, even if they try to shoot. I mean, they cannot shoot because it's bulletproof. Yes. This is your washroom. The washroom is very grand. I believe. Some would say grandiose. It's very grand. The lighting, the space in it, the finishes, everything in this washroom would just ooze luxury. This is a toilet separate from the shower cubicle or separate from the entire washroom, you know? And then the tiles on the wall are textured tiles, very rich. You can see these hexagonal tiles, like the ones you saw the other side, different from the ones in the toilet. This side here, I've got these unique sinks. If, remember, I've got two vanities, double sinks, right? I've got these smart mirrors, anti-mist. I've got a magnifying lens here. I can get to see how ugly I am and even the spots I have on my face from this one. Just in case I would like to apply makeup on myself, but I'm not the kind of person. I'm natural, but I know my wife would like to use this magnifying lens when she's doing makeup. Now, I've got these partitioned again, like the one we saw on the other side. I don't know what you can use this for, but it's important you decide what you want to use it for. People have got different usage for these uh, kind of things. Now, another thing, probably very important, is this one here. This bathtub here is well positioned. So I can sleep here, or I can just soak myself in the bathtub, right? And then have a very, very beautiful view of the neighborhood. From this, because I've got a window here that gives me a clear view of the neighborhood. I've got my you know, towel rocks here, I can hang my towels. There is those fossil windows allowing light into the space. Behind me here, there is this heated towel rack here. You can, you can hang your towels here and just dry them uh, because once I switch it on, it just becomes warm and it dries your towel. The floor has got real textured tiles, very gray, right? Each and every space has got different tiles. That side was hexagonal tiles. This side is gray textured, you know. This one now is a bit different again. And then the washroom has similar ones to the ones in the toilet. And the shower cubicle has got similar textured tiles with the ones you've seen in that toilet. Now come in. Now, party. this shower cubicle in size is similar to the one you saw on that bedroom. Yes, yes, yes. It's very huge. No, but I think that bedroom has a bigger one. Oh, yeah, that looks bigger. Yes. It's the, my first time to see <laughs> a shower cubicle with windows from the top to down. A lot of casement windows here bring light into the shower cubicle. And, yes. And I think also, sorry to cut you No, it's okay. And I think also these windows also just add on to the exterior de design that we show in your Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is what you saw on the other side. Yes, yes. Very important. Now, Paddy, there's something that I'd like to mention again. Now, this rain shower head is a double rain shower head. That means I can take a shower here at the same time with my partner. So we don't need to waste time. We just take the shower at the same time. And the space is so big here. So you don't need to have commotion or, you know, uh, wasting time. You put your soaps here. You can, you can put your uh, shower gel here, you know, well designed and well placed. Very important. And then you shower, the water splashes on the glass. You just wipe it. Very important. <laughs> Only for the rich guys who can afford this. Now here, I don't only have the shower cubicle, I also have an outdoor shower area with a rain shower head over there. Come and show you. If you're bored with the indoors and you want to take a shower on the outdoors, you just come here, take a shower here. Very private, nobody's seeing you. The breeze is just hitting you while you're showering. It's refreshing. 
Nobody's seeing you. Very private. Look at that, it's open. You shower here, or the rain is falling on you. I mean, it's only for, for the elite, only those who can afford this kind of luxury. Very romantic. Yeah, very romantic. <laughs> yeah, you can shower there with your wife if you want to. Yes. Just have some nice moment. Yes. It feels like you're on vacation. Yes. In your property. So this on here, look at this now. You have a balcony in the washroom. You know, you walk into many properties, you don't find that. And this is a selling feature. You've showered, you've wiped yourself, you want to just bask, you know, just have the sun hitting you. You tie yourself in the tower. I want to make a phone call. Exactly. You want to make a phone call, just come sit here, do a phone call. The sun is hitting you. From, just from your washroom. You don't need to go to the lounge or even the other side. Just here. And then if you want to make it more private, you can move these aluminum louvers and make it more private. If you want to kiss with the wife, sit here, you can kiss the wife. And even, <laughs> I, don't, I won't mention, because the same body is very dirty, I won't mention. But you can do everything you want to do on this space because it's private, nobody can see you, man. Let's go this way. <laughs> Thanks for going round with us. I was your host, Boris Yeltsin, in a four bedroom smart house in Lavington, 1.3 million. Until next time, on the same place. Bye bye. I'll see you soon, or the next one. <laughs>